Hello. We've previously learned about listeners and how they can set view model properties, but listeners can do other things as well. One thing is a line target. Here I have two layers, a square and a circle. I'm going to highlight the square and go over here and create a new listener. As you can see, by highlighting the layer first, this automatically sets the selected layer as the listener's target. By default, listeners are set to affect view model properties. But in this case, I don't actually want to do that. So I'm going to click this minus button and then go over here to see what other options this listener has. So as I said, listeners can change view model properties. They can report events, change inputs, but they can also align targets. Now we've been given the option to select our target that we want to align. In this example, I'm going to tap here and go up to my hierarchy and select the circle. If I highlight my listener again, you'll see that our target has indeed been set to the circle. So if I press play, what exactly is going to happen? Well, we are currently listening to the square and whether or not our pointer enters the vicinity of the square. And if it does, the circle will be aligned to our pointer. If I press play, nothing happens when the pointer is outside the square until our pointer enters the square, at which point the listener aligns the target to our pointer. Now let's change the listener. Instead of using pointer enter, I'm going to listen for a pointer move. This means that whenever my pointer is moving within the square, the circle will be continuously aligned with my pointer on every frame that the pointer is moving, unless my pointer goes outside the square, in which case the listener cannot hear the pointer's movement, and so the circle stops getting aligned with the pointer. I can scale up my square so that it covers the entire artboard. I can then hide my square as well, and now when I press play, my pointer is always moving within the vicinity of the square. Therefore, the circle is always being aligned to my pointer. Align target can be used in a bunch of different ways to create interesting rigs for animation. A typical example is a face that continuously follows the cursor.